I think when we talk about markets, markets are in, in sub-Saharan Africa and Africa generally. Markets are probably the only place or the only social space where almost everything that happens in a city happens. A market is that place where everything happens. It's sort of like almost similar or overlapping in terms of theory what Lefebvre calls the third space, what we know as a space of spaces, a space where almost every, everything happens after theoretically. Talking about markets triggers us into understanding space better. The entry point into understanding space is to understand that space is not physical, space is social.
Knowledge in the Yoruba culture. The similarities with other cultures uh, in Nigeria are being transferred from are being transferred orally. We unconsciously think that is not enough. We unconsciously think that is not strong enough. Uh, I think that is not the first question. I think the, the, the first question is to understand how this helps and what this has been able to contribute to the trajectory of history. Yeah. 
the trajectory of human activity when it comes to the market. So the oral taxonomy, the taxonomy of, of, of the oral ritual of passing information down in the Yoruba kingdom is extremely powerful. Tori were ita la shini were ile. In other words, even the concept of were of being wild and difficult, it's acceptable. It's accepted as as a matter of fact. It is cultivated and desired because you know that at one point you are going to encounter difficult people from the outside and to interact and negotiate with the difficult people from the outside you need to bring out your own difficult people too so things are accommodated things are, are accepted and interacted within their own iwa Duna Dura itself, which can be simplified as bargaining. Um, there are no equivalents for it because essentially life to the Yoruba person is a market. At the same time, Life is a journey. A joke. La ye.
There is no such thing as modernism. Modernism is uh, just another ruse to confuse people, to colonize people. There is no society that does not consider itself modern. There is none, except societies that have been colonized. The story goes that uh, uh, Iku, uh, this character that kills things, that terminates things, became a threat to the entire world, to the entire Yoruba world. And at that time, of course, the entire world was just the Yoruba world because we believe that life started with us. So. Uh, Iku was killing all of the important people and uh, everybody became afraid. And uh, the people then came together and said, what can we do about this character that just keeps killing us? Um, and then they said, well, let us give the character a wife and let this character study I let uh, the wife study the weaknesses of Iku so that uh, we can then conquer Iku. So they gave Iku a woman known as Olojongbodu. Olojongbodu is the Obiri Iku, Iku's wife. And uh, uh, Olojongbodu was asked to then go and study the weaknesses of Iku, and uh, Olojongbodu then found out what Iku was allergic to, the things that if Iku ate would give Iku fatal allergies, terminal allergies. So once they found that out, they then gave Iku those things, and Iku died. Iku then um, is just an important uh, vessel for transference. It's not a, a vessel for death. Nothing dies. There are so many places where you could go and interact with individuals who are uh, past. Who, who, who became, who went into the land of the ancestors when they are young. Um, nobody is expected to go into the realm of the ancestors young, uh, but sometimes it happens. Um, what those individuals then do is not really to move out of our realm this just would go to another town. One of the ways through which you can directly interact um, with such individuals who are known as Akudaya, Akudaya um, is to go to the marketplace. The space of the market as, as the space we are you go and see and interact with those who have transitioned a space of total openness everywhere is a portal everywhere everything is is is, is a portal to think about portal we have to think about it in multi-dimensional ways as Ajiri Uniba or no.
was founded in about the 1900s with the Royal West African Frontier Force. It was moved from King's College grounds to land, virgin land provided by the Oba of Lagos. What else about the Balende? Suya. Suya, yes. <laughs> that rings a bell with everybody. Yes. Yes. <laughs> The market is, do, is, is not just a place where you buy, it's not just a, a financial spot where people can uh, do their trade and stuff. It's, it's, it's a cultural place of interaction, both of knowledge, understanding, and also of impact on our culture. What is the meaning of Ayin Lodja and Ojalaye? It's basically saying that the world is a marketplace and that the, the marketplace is also the world. Abalendi is a mixed place. It's, you know, it's like the metropolitan heart of, you say, Lagos Island. Oh no, no, this part of Lagos Island. Because everybody is here, everybody passes through here. The poshest, the poorest, the rasest, the wealthiest. Dangote passes through here. Because this is the only way out of the island. AKA Erubudu, Allah Zaboja, Ije, Uluwazo Market, Obalini. Wow. 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 And so after sunset, people are unable to get their basic needs. And so people started, you know, coming up with these uh, markets for which people heading home after work are able to get, you know, little things that they need maybe to prepare their dinners and things like that. And then they became institutions. There is need for us to begin to decolonize knowledge. And to decolonize knowledge, is to actually go back to our past, what has been in existence, what has been in existence in the past before we had colonization. It's a mystical space. A market in the afternoon suddenly changes uh, in so many ways that the perception of the buyer, the perception of the seller, and the ritual that happens between the buyer and the seller takes on a whole new meaning once uh, it becomes dark. So the fear is not that the archive will disappear. It is that you are not benefiting from the wealth of your ancestral heritage.
awa ki ku nile yo oju ni si lo lara wa awa ki si ku nile yo yin ni dede si lo ni lara koko ogi awa pa ko da ba yin ni nu afefe awa pa ko da ba yin ni nu uji awa pa ko da ba yin jeun lewe awa pa ko da ba yin mu letido awa pa ko da ba yin ni bi egun awa pa ko da ba yin ni bi epe awa pa ko da ba yin ni bi asan awa pa ko da ba yin ni bi oro awa pa ko da ba yin ni bi kilo awa pa ko da ba yin ni bi edidi awa pa ko da ba yin awa pa ko da ba yin awa pa ko da ba yin oja la sale yi oja yin emi oloja ale ara oni na e so eyin eyin alai mo kan mo kan alala yin afoju lasan ariro yin otu obrutu fete atupo yin ara ibe na iba wa se pe yin opoloju iba wa se pe yin opoloju o ba ko firi wa ni wala iba wa se pe yin opoloju o ba ko firi wa ni muro iba wa se pe yin opoloju o ba ko firi wa ni kilo ninu ita ninu akoko ma wi o ju dede ma wi Maro, di gbe de maro. Mo pe o ma wi se o wa, e di gbe de ma wi. Maro, di gbe de maro. Iwa se ni wa gun, iwa gun ni iwa se. Oke kan, oke meji, oke meto, oke meri boro kin yo ra je se ni le yi. Ani se boro kin yo ra je se ni le yi. Oke kan, oke meji, oke meto, oke meri boro kin yo ra je se ni le yi. Oke ri omi eko ti o se ku boju. Emi Olodun ara ara oni na eso abo mi ri eni ni ti ko to oja re. Mo ri o wa e ti gbede mo ma wi. Mo ri o